I am Erica James, and this is number one on the Leafs convo. Leafs fam, hockey world, what's going on? It's another segment of The Take with your man, Kyle Outridge. Number one on this year's top ten list of prospects to watch in the Toronto Maple Leafs organization is Timothy Lilligren, the defenseman from Sweden, drafted first round, 17th overall in 2017, six feet tall, 192 pounds, he's 19 years old, he's right-handed D-man, something the Leafs uh, definitely in need for. He joined the Marlies last year uh, for 44 regular season games, he finished with one goal and 16 assists for 17 points and then he added four assists in the playoffs last year for the uh, Marlies in the Calder Cup playoffs. Uh, Lilligren, he has excellent skating skills. He possesses offensive talent that uh, you know uh, any coach would love to have. His stick handling, his speed makes him entertaining to watch. Uh, he needs a little bit of rounding out done to his defensive game, but he's almost there. And he's uh, he's got a strong passing game, quick release. He's a potential high scoring D man. He likes the puck on his stick, which is what you like to see especially on a young guy he just needs a little more confidence but from what i've seen at the end of the last year and from a little bit in the in the the rookie camp he's definitely starting to get a little more confidence with the puck and and be a little more uh, aggressive with with his playmaking abilities so hopefully he does well and uh he can uh, contend for a a big spot coming up in the next couple years for the leaves but uh, he's definitely going to get a lot of minutes this year with the Marlies, and he's definitely going to get his chance to showcase what he can do. Um, hopefully Sandin, his uh, partner there, number two, can get a chance to get in with the Marlies and play with them. Um, and it'll be interesting to watch these guys uh, grow with the Marlies and the Leafs organization. So we got Lilligren coming in at number one. I really think he's going to be our top guy to watch this year. I really want to see how he does. I really think he's got a chance to get up there in the roster soon with the Leafs and get and get some action so we'll be uh definitely keeping our eye on him this year in rookie camp and see how he does with the marlies thanks y'all for joining me and that's another segment of the take y'all can catch me on twitter at steel saying 03 we'll talk